Alright guys, welcome back to another Steam Free to Play walkthrough. Today we have Destinado, which is a platforming game, I guess that's made by a 14 year old. Uh, that's what the description said anyway, so let's see how good it is. And seizure warning, I know I didn't have the seizure warning in this, I don't really know how to play either, so we'll figure it out. Together, how do I move? Uh, uh, ah, Wasted, okay. I can Wasted. I was trying to use the arrow keys, but lost it will do, I guess. What's up, homie? Heavy breathing! Oh! I need your help! There is this man! He stole a jewel with two W's from my mom! Oh, he's a young kid. Now he's chasing me! You are the only one who, I can, who can help me! Please, please help me! Okay, I'm here. I'm here to help. <clears throat> uh oh, stroke. K. Uh, did I just kill him? Am I the person chasing? I just. M what the? Ah! <coughs> what? Am I the one chasing him? Was I the one? Did I have a choice not to kill him? You found a house. You think is a house. Okay, signal lost. You knocked twice, actually. That was kind of creepy. You got no response. You knocked again. Stop knocking. That knock's too realistic. After that, a man opens the door. His eyes stare in a weird way. He started to breathe differently. <coughs> but you are too confused. Don't make me shank you too. You have been walking for how... for hours. It is now 3 a.m. The man offers you to stay inside and heal your wounds. God, I got this awful cough, guys. Jesus. <clears throat> he thinks the blood is yours. Ha, <laughs> wrong. But you are too confused to even talk. What am I confused by? He pulled you inside his house. <clears throat> without letting you say a single word. Seems like he wants to get shanked. He makes you sit down in a chair in the kitchen with, while making a cup of tea. Be nice if the words just all appeared at once. Everything is too blurry. Your head hurts. You are barely recognized from where the light comes from. You barely recognize where the light comes from. Got it. The man prayers tea. After that, he heads to a room within the first floor. <coughs> Jesus. You hear him closing a door while you look at the cup. <sighs> he gives you the tea, and immediately he apologizes for not presenting himself. Yeah, it's nicer when you get the whole thing so you can just hit the button and then go. He says his name is Victor. I don't have to read it like I'm slow. He leaves. Al he lives alone in this house. As I'm waiting for the words. That was quite empty. It is suspicious. He, is, he looks nervous. You look at each other for seconds while you drink the tea. The tea! His eyes are green. What's with the red and white letters? But at the same time, they are black as void. It's interesting. Are they green or black, bro? Each other stares for seconds as he takes something from behind him. Ah, oh, spaz. Suddenly, he gets closer towards you, trying to undress you. Oh, God. Am I a chick? You start desperately pushing him in a... In the, in the opposite way. Get off me, dog. But he stops. Yeah, you better stop. I'll slash you, too. He understands how comfortable you are. Very uncomfortable. He tells you that in order to heal your wounds, <coughs> you need to take away your clothes. Ah, I'm good. I can do it myself. Thank you, please. Go. But you refuse immediately. Yeah, of course. He looks confused. He understood that you could not make it through the woods without all these blood. Low frequency modes restarting. He asked himself from where you come. Maybe you are not a prophet. This is kind of hard to read. He offers you to sleep in the other room. Why? 
For some reason, you accepted. Oh, God. You could not sleep. At some moment, the midnight, you realize that there is a red light coming from the door. Now you remember, Victor also told you to not open it. When did he say that? I don't remember that. Anyways, you open it. Nice. Way to break the law. <coughs> what is this Satan shit going on here? Pulsing Satan stuff. Weird. Somebody trying to get the knife again? Oh, I can move. It's a miracle. Act 2. Oh, I got rid of all my blood. What's that key do? This was once a house. Interesting. But it does not look like if it's this is so <laughs> if it's still used. Nature took all this back. I wonder if he is living here. I wonder if this is even a house. I don't know, it looked like a house over here. Is the house gone? No, this is still a house, my dude. This is a fence. The house is back there. Press I for pause and menu. Is there a way to make it where it tells me the full freaking things at once? No? Okay, whatever. Lame! E key. <coughs> Progression, baby. Yeah, I like how the dude just tried to randomly undress me. Oh, to heal your wounds, you must get naked! I guess he was trying to treat my wounds, but you can ask somebody. Be like, hey, let me see your wounds. Uh, it's completely black screen. Help. Can't see. Don't enter. Give me time. Wait, there are still people. Don't listen. We need to enter. Seizure. Okay, interesting, interesting. Game broke? Huh. Quite interesting. Eight. I. Enter. What was the pause key again? I don't remember. T? Shift, control, I. I don't remember what the pause key was, but I know. Why is this happening? Hmm. Is this the end? Should I close it and reopen it? Unknown error. Some data will be lost. Oh, okay. We're back, baby. That's kind of creepy and weird. I don't have a stab anymore. I look really freaking weird, dude. What's up, girl? It's your fault. No, it's not. Why did you kill him? Oh, yeah. Get, tell me to do the K button. Stop, please. No. You left us all alone. No, I didn't. I don't even know you. You hurt everyone. <coughs> the world! Nobody in the entire world wants you. Dad won't even look at your tombstone. Am I dead? Weird. You are weak. You get in trouble. You solve them yourself. Whoa, I'm back to the regular world. Nice. What's up, fam? You have finally awakened. Yes, it's I, the awakened one. Why did you come here? I don't know. You just ended up here, dog. I told you to not come here. When? Maybe you don't know this place. How did you tell me not to come here if I don't know this place? This was a mage refuge. But after the Great Prophet's hunt... What are you talking about? What are you talking about? It's now just a place for fulmeters and a walks. What is an A-walk? 
I still strongly believe that there is still a way to turn them. Turn them what? They are still people. But they are trapped on dead bodies. Oh, you are speaking the gibberish to me. I don't want a prophet to find you. They could do terrible things to you. Okay. But now I am marked as a mage. They found out. Huh. I just do not want to hurt you. Interesting. I do not want you to suffer because of me. I don't even know who you are. Is that your dad? Maybe? I don't know. He's a mage. We're a prophet. Or we're the oxer, which is like a dead person in a body or something. I don't know. Seems like he wants to get shanked, though. Am I supposed to press E? Is someone going to die if I press the E key? Maybe if I walk past it, let's see. Does this just go forever? Oh, hell. Found a thing. What did we find? A flashlight? Oh, I can point my flashlight with the mouse, kinda. Interesting. It is very hard to control this. Someone trying to come up behind me? Viewers, beware. You're in for a scare. Good luck pointing your damn flashlight, because it doesn't work right. It doesn't seem. How are you walking in a circle? It does seem to be the case. Maybe I should try to go the other way. I don't know. The music's changing. It's a really weird game. Can't even go the other way. I'm so confused. Ah, oh, this is different. It's an apple. Oh, hell, something dropped. Ooh, what y'all doing? Can't even control my flashlight, damn it. Who wants to get the shank? Execute. Yes or no? Yes. Ah, oh, you just hit the Y key. Is that what it was asking me for earlier? You just hit the Y key? Oh, hell. Shank him! Shank him! Shake the shit! Oh, he ain't dying. Okay, he's immortal. Interesting. Ah, now we are in upside down inverted controls because... Oh, no. Oh, no. Not inverted controls. Oh, that thing was weird. What are we doing, dude? What is our mission in life right now? What's up, girl? You gonna tell me some whack stuff again? Don't you think it? He isn't loving you? I don't know. Ugh, he is not like Dad. He will kill you, you know. Who? Why? You don't deserve that kind of love again. Unless you want to kill mur more innocents. Well, I killed one dude, I don't even know how. Happiness is not for bitches like you. Bitches get stitches, baby. Happiness is not for me, apparently. That's what she said. Ah, oh, it's an arrow. It says go this way. I can dig it. Well, I do not like that chewing sound I'm hearing. Won't let me go. Hmm, confused yet again. I have no idea what's going on in this game, to be honest with you. Do 
you see the struggles with moving this damn camera? Or this flashlight? It is so hard. Up? How do we go up? How does one go up? It says up, but I don't know how. This is as high as this little lady jumps, dude. She does not jump any. Oh, what just happened? I got got. Who is that? Oh, my dad. Interesting. This is kind of creepy. It got me. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Space key. Yeah, get off me. Did I live? Alright, we're in a new world, interestingly enough. Claudia, are you okay? Calm down. It's okay. No, it's not. My name is Emily. I am in charge of Project Nom No More. I actually didn't expect you to expect to send me a helper that fast. Anyways, I suppose my task- look at that face- is to show you the progress. What? Who are you? I am... Be gone, cursed Abaddon soul! Pardon? Shut up! No, you shut up! He is dying. You better keep your mouth closed or else I will boil your teeth! What a... It's threatened. You will be sentenced for heresy! What is your problem? I don't know. Who's that? It did not lie. There really is another base. This will be destroyed and marked as unholy. I have no option. What? Well, what? Well, why error? Enough! <coughs> oh, damn. She just died. Okay. Interesting. Crunch, crunch. And then we're in jail. Here again. You know. Where the pigs are. Where you are. No, I don't. No, I don't. Where you deserve to be. Shit. Can I move? Yay. Up, oh, fam. I guess you're supposed to plus so What? Did he just chop my head off? Is that the end of the game? Why? D key. I am spamming that D key, boys. It's not doing it. Am I supposed to, like, time it? What do you want from me, Deaky? Oh, I'm supposed to hold the Deaky. Ah! I thought it was, like, spam the Deaky. I'll spam the crap out of the Deaky. Interesting. This game is very hard to understand. Might be too big brain for me. Yeah, we're teleporting, baby. What's up? Who's that? What's up, fam? Didn't I just get my head chopped off? What are you up to? Just hanging around? Ha <laughs> ha! Am I supposed to tap it this time or hold it? I'm holding it. Maybe I gotta hold them both at the same time? I don't know, dude. Uh, you tap the E key while you hold the D key, I guess. Or you could just hold them both, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what's going on here. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you. Did we do it? Did we succeed? What is that monstrosity? I don't know. 
Uh, oh, we're in a new world, as it would seem. What are we doing? That's a good question. Does anyone know what's going on in this game? Because I sure do not. I'm some kind of dead person. My dad, it's this little girl stalking me. Yeah, what's up? I don't know why. But I really feel like missing dad. Is that supposed to be me? Why you just kept staring at him? Keep staring at him. You should have done something. But no. You just stolt needed her time. What was that word? Why you don't go to be an obstruction somewhere else? I'm busy. Okay. And for some reason, we have an intruder. Who? Who's an intruder? Is it me? What do you want? Can I slash her? Oh, a lot of the world's problems, I believe. What intruder are we looking for here? Da 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 da. What intruder? Who's an intruder? Oh lord. I feel like the grammar just makes it a little bit too hard to understand this game. Oh. Uh. I went into the cube on accident. Kind of hard to navigate. I just kind of get randomly stuck on stuff. Maybe I need to hit the Y key. Y key? You like the Y key? What do you want from me? Oh, hi. Oh, what's up? The flower dress. Dot 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 dot. What am I supposed to be? I don't know. Well. I certainly don't know. Me neither, dude. Maybe I am your happy part. What? Maybe I represent your beauty. Maybe. Maybe. I, I don't. I just know. What do you know? I just know you erased something from me. Is he mad at me? He mad? Something important from me. <coughs> I'm empty. Why am I here? This program is not even stable yet. I am worthless. I am dead. Why? No. I was dead all the time, wasn't I? Maybe it was a mistake, but you still let me think. Just kill me already. All right, act three, we're waking up in a new room. Who is that? Who are these people? Are these all me? This is some kind of drug infiltrated trip. How do I move? There we go, I can move again. Great. D. E. What's up, fam? Claudia! You're awake! Come! Sit here! Didn't you just die not too long ago? First of all, I'm sorry, Claudia. I didn't know what happened. I don't know what happened. And I lost all my command controls. The only way I can think of would be that someone took them. No. And... We still have to fix your player synchronization. Let me explain you. When I was able to see the files, I saw your player linking program. The amount of data the player receives depends on you. When you are comfortable, focused, happier, well-rested, etc., you get to transmit more data. <coughs> the cut happens when you're something something. I need to get any type of contact from the outside. The only way I can think will be... Magic? I really don't know. 
Did you say magic? Mom! Why, is there something wrong? Oh, don't worry. Mom! Hey, I don't want... To... Yeah? Oh, boy. Mom, I'm bored. Why don't you go to play with... With... Joel's brother, you mean? Yeah. I have not seen him. Maybe he got lost. Again. Why don't you go to search him? He got lost, it is his so fault. So? At the morning. Taking our guests to Yekaterina's house. Are you sure? You are helping us? Aw, oh, that's so sweet. Thank you. Shh. Tomorrow I will take you two to meet Yekaterina. She will probably help you. Ah, oh, thank you. I'm just doing it because I'm bored. Just go to sleep. Who is the doll here? What? Oh my god. He wants to- what just happened there? I didn't get to read any of that. Emily. Oh yeah? I- I don't know what is happening. I mean, I know nothing. Everything is going so fast. Kind of scared. I just... Just... What? You just what? I feel useless. I'm sorry. I don't understand what you say. I don't understand what you say. <coughs> what you? You were the one who got us out of there. Out of where? That one place? It's not your fault. Because of my fault that we were trapped here. I'm really sorry. Please. Just don't leave me. Don't leave me. Okay. We're going to Yekaterina's house now, right? We have our shanking knife. Wanna get shanked? Are you ready? Yes. As ready as I'll ever be. Okay, do you even know Yekaterina? No. Do you believe in the prophets? No. I'm not sure. Well, let me tell you, Yekaterina is a mage. My mom doesn't know, of course. You have to keep it a secret. I'm not really sure that will fix the problem. But I mean, we could try. Just follow me. Okay. Let's go. Don't worry, Ladia. I won't left you. <laughs> Will you write me, though? <laughs> Act 4. Act 3 was really short, actually. Who is it? Your dear Anavi. Remy, open the door. It's me, Anavi. Let us in. I need to talk to Yekaterina. Cat Torino. Welcome, Anna. Miss Yekaterina will arrive shortly. She's kind of busy. Thank you, Caddy. What is with this new animation? I see you came with some guests. Mind if I bring some tea or coffee? <coughs> um, no thanks. Did the grammar get better? What about you? Would you like coffee or tea? Yes. What is this? What? Bring me my coffee or tea. Cats, Yusha. Anavi. Darling, I have missed you a lot. How long has it been? It's been so long. You get the... Got any problem in the way? Well... My mother... She really doesn't like getting alone, does she? Doesn't she? Well, we can't change her. So, are you going to present to me your friends? No. Well, then present yourselves. What a bitch. My name is Emily. Nice to meet you. Fourteen-year-old shouldn't use that word. Um, people call me Ladia. Oh dear, you look terrible. Oh, do I? Do not worry, my comrade. You could get a shower, and I could hand you some clothes, comrade. Lord. 
than help. Player, that's me. Can I say something to you? Only if you use legible, like, a fluent sentence. Please. I'm really scared. That's pretty good. I thought this was a dream. A really long dream. You're doing good. I just went to travel blind. Then, then this happens. You were doing so good! To become a drop of water in the sea. But the more this dream lasts, I sensed an increasing fear. But now, it stopped. It's weird. I'm scared. Still scared. Okay. A new animation style once again. Yes. It's a black book Kat Yusha gave me. It's about a dress code and an exact dress called Pianus. I didn't know that was the type of dress, but... Oh, I clicked it again. My bad. The Pianus dress code, baby. It's a bed. A little small to be for guests. I don't care anyways. A bed is a bed. The design reminds me of something. Excuse me. <coughs> That's a door, and I don't want to open it. Interesting. Okay. You want to open this door? That's a door, and I don't want to open it. Okay. Yet again. Such insight into doors you don't want to open. What's up, fam? Who are you? Ladia. I was searching for you. Why? It's already dinner time. Miss Cat Yusha wants you to come eat with us at the dining room. Okay, take me away. Woo! We did it. Dinner time. New animation style. Ladia, please come join us. I'm already here, dog. You are a little sleepy, aren't you? Could be said. She does really enjoy it. Enjoy what? I'm just a bit tired. What's up with your dress? It looks wh wider. Yeah, I know, right? It's actually... <laughs> that face. Actually, another dress Kat Yusha gave me. I am now a woman of high elegance. I am now a woman of high elegance. Great, you came here to eat. I was talking to Emily of something very important. You can sleep, eat, and be treated like me in here. What does that mean? With one condition. You will help me in the return of my husband. Just a simple magic spell. Do one of you know how to play the piano? Yes, of course I do. I do. Claudia does too. I'm freaking out, man. Uh, uh. Nice, nice, Claudia Chan. Remy, can you bring me the bring the dessert? We will start making the set out tomorrow. For now, we may rest. Finally, some good food. Is that cake? Are you going to eat everything on the table by yourself? Stop flaming me. I love sweets. Ah, it's time to piano. Murder piano. Here will here will it be the ballroom we are going to dance here. The sheet music should already be there, is it? Yup. Whoa, the stars look amazing from here. They look like dots to me. Ladia, I'm not certain, but maybe the spell works with only two persons in the room. Ah, uh, should I leave? Oh yeah, I'm sorry. See ya. Oh, Ladia, I need answers. About what? What sort of answers? What the hell did you just bring upon this cursed? No, I don't understand you when you talk that with that manners. I don't either. Okay, I'm gonna say it once more. What in the bloody hell is that? Ah, what is it? I don't actually know. I just know we need to take care of it for some days. We? Sounds like you used the term in plural. Uh, yeah, I know, I know. It's just that I need some help. Okay, fine. I will take care of it, too. In the end, it's not like I had- if I had many uh, things to do. 
Ah. Claudia, that thing grew an eye. Yeah, that's pretty creepy. What? What? Holy shit, what in the fucking hell is that? Be away from it. It could explode. You're telling that can also explode? Uh, yeah, something like that. Damn it, if only Victor were here. Who's Vi I remember Victor, but I don't remember exactly. Oh, he's the guy from the house. What? The door is open. What? Who is that guy? Victor? That's Victor? Whoa, the plot's really not coming together at all. Hey, Ladio, we meet again. Thanks for taking care of Valancia. I don't remember Valancia. You just made that up. What's up, fam? What the fuck dish dish used magic? I don't know. Wait, what the hell are you, Victor? Well, I don't know. Am I? Of course you are. There is no other asshole such as you. Why am I suddenly an asshole? I don't know. You turn from visiting us every day to literally ignoring us. Not a word. Not even a letter. You don't totally forgot about us. Not even since Marcos. Who is Marcos? Yes, I know, and I'm sorry. But things didn't go well for me, either. And I also refuse to believe you would get that mad at me. Well, yes, I am really pissed off because someone has inter just interrupted me. Oh, it was probably El Blanchia. Why well, did it, though? I'm trying to bring back Marcos' drop dope Lego. I'm the pianist, hi! What is going on? Yeah, I remember you. Your name was Emily, right? <coughs> yes, I am. Well, I was not very deep in the Doppelago stuff, but I might help. My wife was making a research about that, so I know enough. Enough to tell that that dress color won't work. Well, I gave Ladia a, ca a catalog. I think it is in her bedroom. Then Ladia, please bring the book. Catalog. Whatever, just bring it. Ah, dang it. Stop telling me what to do. Y'all ain't even my real dad. Blame. Grab the book. It's a black book Kat Yusha gave me. It's about a dress code, an exact dress called Pianist. This is the book. Yeah. Get it. Can't get out of here. It's not letting me out. There we go. What's up, fam? Are you gonna murder me? Please don't. What did you do? Tell me, Ladio. What the fuck did you use to change all this? Was it Control Z? Tell me how the fuck you just changed Destiny. My destiny. I didn't hit Control Z, dude. What am I now supposed to be? I'm gonna take back the chaos I was intended for. You can't break destiny. My destiny. I just hit Control Z. <laughs> I don't know if I was supposed to do that, but fuck it. What's up, fams? I got the book. Thank you, Ladia. Let's see. You see, you should have tried a dark color instead. The point of the pianist collar is to observe as much light as possible. <coughs> yes, I know. We need the Doppelago to focus on me. Yes, I'm gonna give Emily another dress. No, we can't use the same pianist. Why? Because of the same reason you can do it just once each day. Do you know any other person that knows how to play the piano? Me. Ah, it's a VHS tape. It's me, the pianist. Huh. You are sleeping again, aren't you? I don't know. Very tired of my job. By the way, do you remember that guy? His name was something like Morum or so. I think it was Mortem. He was a very cool dude. Wonder why he left. <coughs> He's kind of a weirdo, but still a cool guy. He had that weird aura of protectiveness, like if he cared about us. He just said he was getting weaker every hour. So eventually he didn't show up anymore. Ha! Just like that. Ha! Got him. Anyways, there wasn't so much material to work with, so I did what I could. Just try to be as expressive as you can. Don't limit your emotions when it rips off your what? Whatever. Huh. You are sleeping again, aren't you? I don't know. Yeah, I guess I was. 
Interestingly enough. Where am I supposed to go? I don't feel like reading. Okay, cool. You feel like sleeping? I really don't want to sleep. Well, we can't get out of here either, so I don't know what you want. Oh, maybe I can go down here. Ah, something with the window. Yay. This would be a really, I really like the illustrations and the, like the different art styles and stuff. But I just wish I could understand what the hell is going on. What just happened there? Girlie, what are you doing here? You look very lonely in here. You know, early to bed, early to wake makes a lady smart, pretty and great. And so gets healthy, but socially dead. Ah, oh, come on. Don't be silly. Tell me, why are you here? I don't know. Why are you here? Nah, nah, nah. I asked first. You'd want to know it. Okay. I like the stars. I'm displeased, Ladia. What? It's true. I think that is the only thing I love the most. Well, no. I like roses, too. You didn't answer me, Ladia. Why are you here? There's really no point in lying, huh? I don't want to sleep. I really don't. There are these nightmares with a girl. And she won't stop tormenting me every time in my sleep. Wait, wait. Does that girl grow? Yeah, kinda. Oh my. Ladia, you just saw your doppelago. A dopelo go. Is it bad? Is that bad? Those creatures were made to test the sanity of being by torturing them. They're doing a good job, but they activate just when the subject is in the border of insanity. My god, Laudia, are you okay? No. I know this has been a really weird tr wild trip, but... Tell me, Laudia, what does it tell you? I... I, I really don't want to talk about that either. I know, we just know each other for a few days, but it's really important for you to tell me. It, it talks about my dad. I know this might get you uncomfortable, but is he dead or something? I, I honestly don't know. Although, tell me he isn't, just because of that would means carbon carnival. I used to play the organ at the local church in my town. Until the carnival, my first carbon carnival, they, they tried to, there was blood, then the door opened, and there was dad, he fought for me, and my cold and poor body did nothing for him, it was my fault that I saw him die before, it sounds like he was trying to protect you, no no, it shouldn't have gone that way. It was my fault all along, just because I didn't do anything. I should have been the one who died there, not him. Ah, oh, she slapped me. How old were you? What? Your age. Uh, like eight or so? Don't you ever dare to say that again. It wasn't your fault nor his. You just couldn't do anything, and that's okay. I could have done something. No, no. It wasn't your fault. Your father was protecting your your smile. You think he wanted to be the way you to be the way you are? He wouldn't have wanted for you to smile. He would have wanted you for you to smile, Jesus. Don't be like that. I bet he would like you to smile. And I promise you that I'll make everything I can to heal you. No matter what. You could heal the grammar. I would really enjoy this game, I think. I really like the, like the different art styles. Just don't know. I still don't know what the hell is going on. Except that my dad possibly died in something called the Carbon Carnival. And I have something called a Doppelago fucking with me. That's about all I've gotten from this. The dick thing called a Doppelago. Not the Doppelago. You never feel like reading. 
up? What are we doing now? We're gonna go double Lego down here, right? Or we're gonna go this way, I guess. <coughs> What's up, fam? I got a question. How do we take care of that thing? I mean, it doesn't have a mouth. Yet. <laughs> it has a name and it's Avaladia. Yes, yes, I understand. But how does he eat, though? How does she eat? Oh. She appears to absorb the food through her, the, her skin. Although I won't dare to feed her be before Victor and Emily come. Neither do I. Oh, Ladia, dear. Oh. So wonderful you came. I have to tell you something. Listen, Emily talked to us. Victor and me. She said fucking wait, wait. What just happened there? She didn't mean it to harm you. She wanted to help you. That's why she talked to us. And so why I sent Victor and her to buy some stuff. We want to help you. I want to help. Because I need you to help me. Fine. But how? Great. There's a technique which we never used, and I don't think Victor has done it either. <coughs> you will do something we call pragmatic fusion. You will do something similar to fusion with your Doppelagolo. Well, no, it would be more accurate to say your fusion with your world. A total fusion with your Doppelagolo would cause severe damages as your personality would vanish. Could vanish. Just be aware of it. And so, we'll begin at night again. Going Doppelabla logo. Alright, let's do it. Emily, are the sheets in the correct order? Are you ready to Doppelabla logo? So it seems. Fine, I just need to register this. Anna V? She went to look for something, Victor asked her. She will come later. Ooh, my stomach growl. Okay, but the sun already hid, and we don't know how much time we will need. You better start now. Why am I here? I thought you said you needed two people. I just have a question. How will you get the piano to work? By playing it? With the help of the spell you guys brought. What spell? What? Wait, Latin. Oh yeah, that's right. That's the way it's programmed. How could I have forgotten? Alright. Be okay, Emily? No, we are not okay. Yup. Thumbs up. Okay, Ladia. This will be forced. It won't be like the dream. Try to convince your Doppelago of things it doesn't want to hear. But whatever it may happen, do not fusion yourself with it. Ready? Emily, start. It's coming to double up the go go. Execlorum ipsum 35. Paro volorum ex specium. Lepidium satium 54. Vortel bulli and ex. Ut unis. Reservari statum ferrari. SE2 equals subject for language. Reservar to statum. UI statum. What is this code? What are we doing here? That's our armor statium. Why? Purplejoe.com. We're freaking out, man. I'm having a stroke. <laughs> oh, what is that? A mushroom tree? Evil mushroom tree. Total accurate battle simulator. Oh, I'm super fast. And I have mad hops now. What's up, Doppelabba logo? You ready to catch these hands? Ladia, I know my eyes won't deceive me. What the fuck are you doing here? I came to talk to you. The fuck you want to talk to me? About what can we do? What does we mean? You and me, our future. We can get to a... I don't understand a shit of what you mean. About Dad. Why do you even want to talk about him? Because Emily was right. He did love me. Oh, you let her brainwash your mind? Don't you remember how your naked body was attached to chains anymore? No, it's not that. I know he loved me, and you should know too. Why do you want to stick with me in the pain? He loved us, and that's what matters. No, no, it can't be. You don't understand. 
You're lying, you fucking liar. Are you gonna pretend all those memories of him never existed? Don't you remember all those happy moments we had? Stop. Stop! No, I won't. Boss fight? I don't want to look back and be wounded by the past. I want us to evolve, Digimon. And I know at the bottom of my heart he did sacrifice himself to save us. Don't you see it? It wasn't my fault. He did love us. Stop it, please. I can't hear anything more of that. Please stop. Don't do anything. You don't know what you are, you are doing, too. I want to tell you what is true. I want to settle this once and for all. I don't want to feel guilty anymore. And all this time, I've been alone. He wounded me. And all I need was just another voice out of my mind. Stop it. You're killing me. Got him. Do we win? It got some. Katayusha? Did it work? He's still there, but I know I'm done. Nice, nice, Lydia. Katayusha! Wow, she does really want her husband back. What? Don't you see it? She did keep the spell going for the entire night. Not even Emily could persist playing the entire night. And she even let her sleep while staying here with you all night. Even Victor offered himself to keep the spell, and she refused. Her body can't keep up anymore. Caddy does really need a pianist. My turn to pianist, I guess. That was kind of cool. What is- Aw, oh, yes! This is what I really needed. You hear that, player? I love this. Hmm. Cool. And... Good. What? Uh oh. Are they gonna drop a toaster in the water? Oh, hi there, Victor. How you doing? Yeah. Uh... Came here to bring you these clean clothes. Thanks, fam. Uh... Is there something else you need? No. Tell me a joke. What? A joke? Yas, whatever it might be, just hit me with one. Uh... How many tickles does it take to make an octopus laugh? Eight. Haha, <laughs> okay, tell me. Ten tickles! Ah! <laughs> Are you a dad or something? That was a good one. That was fucking awesome! No, seriously. Are you a dad? Do you have any kids? Uh, well... I don't think I have any kids. Ten tickles. <laughs> I have a wife, though. Oh, really? Well, how was she called? Some of these words go too fast. Oh well, her name was Clara. I'm not even hitting anything, it just scrolls sometimes. And she was as beautiful as smart. She sounds interesting. She was. But why do you speak as if it were the past? Did you guys break? Well, not exactly. You, you'll see, Ladia. My job consists of traveling. I travel from base to base to send messages or close deals among our bases. At one time, I had to travel six months, days outside our main base, while Clara continued her investigation. Once I returned, found that our base was raided by prophets. And most of the people we know, my co-workers, my comrades, were killed. And the one who survived were turned into fulminators or walks. What is an awok or fulminator? What is that? And Clara... <laughs> <coughs> I found her body full of red blood. I almost didn't recognize her. The last least I could have done for her was making a grave. Besides a beautiful blue growing flower, glowing flower, that's why I take care of Avalanth Avalantia. Although I can't experiment much, much with them. I would have tried to help them, but now it's me who would save the ones left. That was many years ago, and no, we didn't have any child as far as I know. Oh, I'm sorry about that. You know, if I had to describe her with one color, I'd go for light blue. I don't know why, but it fits perfectly with her. Oh, I'm sorry for taking your time. I'll let you enjoy your bath. Thanks, fam. No, wait. Can I ask you a question? You think I should play the piano for Caddy? I mean, I haven't played the piano for a long time. Well, she really went to her limits just to help you. In fact, she was so tired that she has been sleeping for the entire day. 
I think it would be nice of you to give back the favor. Yeah, I know. I could do that. You want, I could tell her once she wakes up. Yeah, do that. What is, oh my god. Let's play this piano, son. Piano time. Malfunction script. What is happening? Go over here. Who are you? Avalantia's room. What are you doing, Ricky? Who are you? Who are you? Avalantia, is it you? Avalantia. Avalantia. I just apologize for this light being a possible inconvenience, but I found myself in a very unpleasant feel, a confused and lost state. Please, would you take a consideration and help me answer some questions I have? Sure, ask what you want. Where am I? You are in the match of Yucatarina. I honestly don't know her second name. There are lots of Katyushas who own matches. But that is okay. Another question. Seems to have lost memories. Whatever is happening to my body to make me slowly recover my form? Do you know who I am? Who am I? I don't know who you were before. You were turned into a fulminator. It was a tragic event. After that, a man named Victor rescued you. Do you know who he is? Who is he? I think I have heard that name before, but... Ugh, my memories. I'm sorry, but uh, my mind a milkshake right now. I can barely keep thoughts in order. Please pardon me, but I have another question. Could you help me? What do you mean? Kind of afraid of what might happen before my memory totally recovers. And uh, I think I remember stuff, but uh, please keep me in secret until I recover my last memories. At least until I re recover from this unsettling form. And about that guy, Victor somewhat feel like I know him, and that I should tell him something very important. Ugh, I'm sorry for wasting your time, it's just my mind is diffused. Yeah, but do you remember who was he? I don't know. Just remember I have something important to tell him. It's okay, but you'll have to wait. He is going to return in two days from a trip. Very grateful. Would you mind giving me your name? People call me Ladia. My name is Yume Musooka. Musooka. Although I don't know why, but people call me Ladia, and I like it. So, call me that way. Then thank you, Ladia. Interesting. What's up, fam? Ladia, wake up! Wake up, you little sleepy. Don't you remember? You made an appointment with Caddy. Aw, oh, come on, wake up already. You have to get on this dress. I bet black will look great on you. Ugh, why don't you move? Ladia. Wake up. Bloody hell, give me a second. No. Emily! I won't stop until you get out of the bed and look pretty as the woman you are. There is no way you will change my mission. You don't... Don't you know what privacy is? Glamour knows no limits. Aw, oh, come on, get out. Never! Oh shit. Oh shit! Player, oh player. What a ride. What a beautiful ride this was, huh? Since the early moments of my life, I've had struggles to keep breathing joyfully. But these experiences, player, oh player, you truly showed me another world. You made me know new faces and to have a singular experiences. And I'm happy with things turn out this way. Who knows? You could have killed us all if things were that way. Oh my gosh! Ladia, you look so cute! I told you Black was going to look great on you. I can't fucking breathe, Ladia. Your cuteness is going to kill me. No, Emily, stop. I want to sleep more. I call bullshit on that. You are prettier standing up than laying in bed like an ugly sloth. I'm thankful for that. For creating me a very first truly smile. Are you smiling? Oh, you smiling. Even you know I'm right. Come here, girl. You know what <laughs> you have got a job to do. Now I understand humans are naturally passive and good. And it truly warms my heart. 
All right, all right. How? What? He he. Yeah, yeah. All right, we're piano in now, I guess. First of all, Ladia, thank you. Game was possible by viewers like you. Thank you. I'm glad that both of us could overcome our inconveniences and help us to evolve with each other. And for the sake of your acts, we will not forgive your intention. What? I owned you one, Caddy. I really did. Is the sheet in the correct order? I don't know. <coughs> yes, I think. And I'll start. Ego exalted lucibus lectum. Donic nobis invexic. Quasque possumus longus exalted nobis. Donic nobit divetsket. What are we summoning here? Ego my lego. Lego my ego, son. What's up, girl? Avlatia's room. Oh, Avlatia, you... You have truly changed. Hours ago, I had the body of a child, but now I know I look like to be a full adult. The tentacles were finally gone. And so my memories. Well, some of them. Really? Do you remember your name now? Yes, yes I do. And so I remember who is Victor and what is my message for him. You're Clara, right? Probably. Is Victor yet to come? I really want to tell him. Tell him what? I love him. Audio, my name is Clara. Called it. Vanderlova. That's the only thing that's made sense this whole game. Wait, what? Are you really his wife? But, 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 but. But Victor said you were dead. He just conveniently plot wise said you were dead days ago. <laughs> He said, uh, saw you covered in blood, and he even dug your, up your own tomb. What the hell? Don't say me your message was that you're pregnant. Well, holy shit, you gotta be kidding me, right? Damn. But then you have to tell him that, but would he even recognize me? I have recovered some memories, but I am still in inhuman body. What if people start looking, still look, look me as if I were a monster? Oh, don't say that. You totally have defined and sexy ass women looking for him. I'll make sure you get to see him. You know what? You'll see him tonight. That usual will make a bigger dinner tonight. Now that we have completely successfully, completed successfully her spell. And Victor will be there. <coughs> don't. Everybody's getting married except for me. Interesting. What's up, girl? Avalantia, listen to this. I will open the door which leads to the ballroom, which has been set up for a dinner. Therefore, I will present you to Victor and... But what if he doesn't reckon... Clara, Clara. Calm down. If he doesn't recognize you, I will tell him that it is you. But what if he has already had another wife? We already know this is not true. He doesn't! Victor is one of the most loyal people I've ever met, and you should know that. He came from a long way from trying to strip me down. How much do you love him? I love him as much as I could give my life for him. Great. That's great. I will open the door, and you will give Victor the most joyful moment of his entire life. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. Yes, I am. Things are going to get dirty. Are you sure you want to continue? Oh, so that was a happy ending. I guess we'll just continue and get the sad ending. Oh, hail. Plot twist. Oh, Ladia, did you saw it? Whoa, who are you? What are you? Oh, Ladia. My reasons and motivations are... Really way far from your understanding, and I bet only Mortem will hear you, please. Did you hear me, Mortem? I bet you tried really hard. But whatever you make, I will always get ahead of you. Ha! Your wishes have already wakened you. You will never change my destiny! 
What did you do to make him care, Troll Z? Uh, although this it means this is not even true, but then it means do I also am I? I wish I could have saved. Oh, it's a superhero. What's up, fam? What the hell is going on? Oh, darling. You did throw someone thing as weak as your Doppelago weapons would hurt weaken me? I have to admit, his imagination is truly glowful. Or did you do it yourself? Oh, hell. This thing died, too. Interesting. Everything's dying. That thing's OP. Oh, this is really gets annoying. Let's finish this real quick, will we? I'm gonna stab you. Wait, no! Oh, I'm sorry. Did I bother you? I'm sorry, Ladia. Please, don't, don't. You don't want me to touch you? Because if you don't want me, I won't hurt you. R really? No, you fucking donkey. Did you call me a donkey? Do you honestly throw I came here for a sam fucking sandwich or something? Fuck off. These are not 14 year old words. You call me a fucking donkey. <laughs> okay. Your soul was truly colorful, Ladia. Awesome 41, 76, 61 encountered exec. Game broken. Ooh, we He's starting. Now restart from the be happy. <laughs> That's the Nadia. Made by Diego Alman. I just died at the end and it called me a fucking donkey. Lol. Thanks for playing. Man, I don't know what happened in this damn game. <laughs> oh, it could have been, like, I think this would have been a really good game if, like, the grammar was better, better and I could understand it. Shit, I hit the escape key. God dang it. I might play through it again so you guys can see the other ending. Uh, it took me two, it took me a whole hour to get to the end of it one time, though. I don't know, that's pretty questionable. Let's see. Maybe if I click to be happy. I wonder what happens though. I want to know. There should be a save. Uh... I wish there was a save fucking thing. Auto save or something. Oh, here's credits. Alright, I'll try to get the- see if there's two endings to this. Play the credits first, and I'll try to get to the second ending. Oh, dope! I don't have to start all the way over for them. That's dope. Good job, creator, for making it where you don't have to dang play it all over again to get the second ending. That's good. <laughs> Do you think I came here for a fucking sandwich, you donkey? <laughs> that's a, that's crazy. Yep, when you summon Satan, bad stuff happens. Yeah, got it. Alright, let's go. There should be like a skip. Go, go, go.
kind of like when you get to the end of the Dark Tower series, if you read those books by Stephen King, and he's like, oh, if you want a happy ending, stop reading here, but then you read the whole ending and then all that crazy stuff happens. That's like not happy. Basically the same thing just happened there. Oh, Lord. Sexy ass woman looking for him. Give me the second ending. Okay, happy ending time. Be happy. Yeah. Oh, the game. What? Oh, well. Hi, right, guys. Uh, this game was like, it had a lot of potential, and I really liked the art style and how it kept changing and stuff. And the story seemed like it could be very interesting, but it just seemed like it was missing a lot of like plot points, and it just escalated so quickly. It was really hard to keep up with what was going on. The pacing was just so abrupt. It was like, I still have very little, like, I got general plot stuff that I had, like, some kind of alternate personality that was bringing me down and stuff, and then we conquered it because my dad died or something. And then we were trying to do some kind of ritual, and a damn demon thing that's been fucking with me the whole time murdered me um, and everything else. But I still don't know how we got to all these points. I don't know how we met all these other characters. Like, they just kind of popped up. But yeah, it was a high game. It, it, it could have been a really good game if it made sense. But if you like videos like these, please like and subscribe.